We got in late last night. Had a really good night's sleep. Slept in, I think it's like 10.30 right now. Yeah, I slept until about 10. So, got out, went out. I don't wanna go out and stress the goats out just yet. <laughs> um, we're letting them settle. They're a little stressed out. I kind of peeked in on them this morning to check on them. Uh, see if they're checking if they're drinking their water eating hay they are kind of starting to walk around the trailer unfortunately rosie the little black and white uh doe and shadow our first our older buck they're still very very scared but thankfully uh juniper the blue doling she is wary of us she's still not sure of us um, I can catch her, hold her, she'll sit still, she'll let me pet her, and she's starting to kind of figure it out. But, uh, <laughs> little Salem, he is so sweet. He walks right up to me, he's like, oh, you give me scratches, I like you. So, I'll show you guys them here soon. We're actually gonna go make a run to Tractor Supply to go get a couple extra supplies beforehand. Um, just some, like, probiotic paste and, um such to help with the stress of the move give them a bit of a boost and then we're going to get them out to the farm to um to get them set up and settled in so they can start getting used to their new home <laughs> did you hear them we just got out to the pasture this morning to get them set up in their pens because sophie's staying at a friend's we've got mocha set up in the buck pen where we know she can't get out and she's good in there hi mocha has Get low and call Salem. Salem! 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 Yeah, I understand that they're, they've been in that trailer for a long time. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what is in there? Those are chickens. Mocha might like them. She probably will. She because, was because of the other ones. Yeah. All right. Let's see how she reacts. We're gonna go ahead and uh, try putting Mocha in here and observe them and watch them because they're pretty. They're good size. They can get away if they need to get away from her. <laughs> Sweet little Salem. He's so fluffy. He is very fluffy. He's gonna have a really beautiful coat. Oh, Juniper! Juniper! His winter coat is going to be so fluffy. Like Salem's going to be the first to test it. pushing, yeah. Got the fence on. And our fence doesn't hit like super, super hot. Just hot enough that'll make you feel funny and be like, I don't like that. Oh, there he goes. Oh, wait. Leon, did you turn the fence off at the charger? No, he, he, we disconnected it with there. The fence should be still be on. Like I said, it doesn't hit very hot. Just hot enough for it to feel funny. It sure feels like he's not even feeling it. No. He's not. Mm. I even brought the fence away from. 
it, Leon. Or go ahead and disconnect it, Leon. Can you go open up the shed and go get the fence energizer? Or the fence tester? Oak is such a good goat. She really is. She leads so nice. And she's a mommy. Maybe she'll hopefully she'll be because she's all by herself. Hopefully she'll be very happy to see them. She'll probably start looking up. them but she's not going towards them so that's good it's okay Mocha. I know mama she wants to be your friend juniper <laughs> very vocal she is locust going for the hay <laughs> She's like, I want that hay. <laughs> These guys look really happy to be having some grass. Hey, Mama. Well, so far, that's pretty good. Let's go ahead and we'll go ahead and get. Uh, oh shoot. Well, I'm trying to remember these names. Rosie and Rosie and Shadow, but I don't want to put Rosie in there. Shadow's gonna be by himself for a bit because I, I want him to get a little bit bigger. But Rosie's gonna come in here and she's gonna meet Mocha. And Juniper. That's Juniper. And that's Salem. She's so pretty. I know. Hi, pretty girl. But Salem's my favorite. See, I think he might have a protein deficiency, protein or a mineral deficiency, and that's why he's kind of pot bellied like that. So, we'll work on him. The rest of them are, look perfect. <laughs> Excellent shape. How old is Salem? Salem and Juniper are about 10 weeks old now. Wow. I know. New place, new home, so much to take in. But I bet you like it way better than being in that trailer. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and we'll get Shadow. So I got a packet of vitamins and electrolytes a jumpstart probiotic paste and then i also got them a vitamin b complex gel as well just to give them a little boost after the stressful trip just connect it and then you can test it he's still got his face in it which means he does not care all right test it Come on, test That's it. what it sounds like? Yep. All right, find a metal. Find the metal. It's hitting at 1.7. Holy cow. It's not. Yeah, because it'll, it'll, it, it pulses. That's how this works. But that is, that needs to be hotter. It's because we got all this grass here. I haven't been able to try and weed eat. Yeah, I, uh. I started, I moved the fence off of the grass where it's low, where they've grazed. Well, so far, Mocha's not paying any attention to them. She's just kind of over there eating hay. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get these babies. Water situation taken care of. Okay, my camera died, so I'm on my phone now. But Salem just tested the fence and he fainted. <laughs> so he has learned that the fence doesn't feel good. We don't want to touch the fence, which is good. That's what we don't want. We don't want goats that are going to be sticking their face through the fence and ultimately pushing over or getting tangled in it. So that's good. Let's go ahead. We'll get them caught, get their electrolyte. Oh, I almost, I almost, I almost went into the fence. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get them taken care of, get their electrolytes. And then we got to go get Sophie. All right. We'll go ahead and give Leon's hi Mocha. You're doing so good with the babies. Mocha actually has been very sweet to the babies. She came over and investigated little Juniper. 
어, 자. 네. <웃음> And the fainting begins. Poor baby. <웃음> Hi, Juniper. Hi, baby. So you can kind of see she's got some tan coming in on her eyebrows. So she's got a little bit of that also on her legs. Look at those cute little feet. I know, baby. So we got ear tags made. Look. <laughs> she says, look at it. Look at how cute those are. Those look so cute. Pretty girl. All right, let me go ahead and get her stuff. Salem's just hanging out with Leon. This. All right, okay, Liam. All right, okay, buddy. Can you hold Salem's head for me? Hold Salem's head up. There we go. I'm gonna put this in his mouth. I know that tastes. There you go. Oh, that tastes good, huh? All right. Get, up, get that down. Oh, don't. Oh, oh, pick him back up. Pick him back up, bud. Pick him up. You got him. Here we go. Get his hind legs. Get him up in your lap. There you go. All right, let's finish giving him the rest of this. He's just got a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Oh, does that taste funny? I know. Come on. Here, come here. Oh, I know. Oh, come on, come on. In your mouth. In your mouth. There you go. Good no, boy. Oh, come here. Gentle with him. Oh, it's love at first sight. I think Mocha loves her. I love Sam. She looks just like your babies, don't they, Mocha? Yeah. I love Sam. Well, that's good. This is excellent. I know that they're going to be good with her. Yeah, she hasn't even tried to headbutt at him or nothing. Yeah. That's such a good girl, Mocha. I love Salem, and I think Salem loves me. Salem's a cutie. Yes, you are. You're your baby. And see, look at Salem's. Salem's got his ear tag. And I'll share a link down below on where I got these. I actually ordered these from a Etsy seller and I actually have a 10% off coupon as well. I'll share it below. Just a little bonding going on over there. Okay, so now we're gonna get shadow. We'll get Shadow, get him his stuff, and get him in the buck pen. Hi, Penny. Hi, Hannah. You guys looking so good. Hi, babies. All right, baby. Let's go ahead and get this last two out and set up in their pens. So obviously we're gonna have an easier time with Salem and Juniper. Shadow, we might be able to figure out, but Rosie is absolutely terrified. So I don't know if we'll be able to tame Rosie. It's going to be... It's going to be a, uh, a chore. Yeah. All right. Oh, we got the collars. That's right. Let me go get the collars. I'll shut this right here. We got collars to have an easier time at catching them. And if we need to tie them up for any reason. have her already I'll go ahead and bring in I got the collars and I'll go ahead and give her the paste coming in oh I'll start giving her like apple treats and stuff she really is stunning I'm coming here. It's okay, baby. Just going nice and slow. There we go, baby. It's okay. So I noticed something. They're kind of backwards. Yeah. Like they have to be, they don't sit naturally like this. We sit like that, so I, I'll, I'll reach out and see if there's a way we can, I don't think we can undo them and redo them. All right, so here is Rosie. She's the one who is, she's, I think she's just very scared from the move and us being new, but look at her eyes. She has what's called marble eyes where they're brown and blue, but she is black and white with a solid black face. Look like that. Here, I'll push that in. Get 
put it in. Okay. Push it in. Gotta get that in your mouth. There you go. That's a good girl, baby. Is it good? Yep. Oh, wait, no, actually, I gotta get this one. That's right. We have two others. Oh, oh baby. Well, hide your face. Davis has. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> this is Shadow. This is our first buck. He's the oldest buck. He's about a year old now. He was born July of last year. Here we go. Poor baby. I'll give you an arm to hide. Oh. Okay. Okay, honey. There you go. All right, we're going to get your collar on. The gate's already open. Annabelle, you guys, you got new neighbors. Or a new neighbor for now. Eventually neighbors. Well, look at that big old horse uh, flies. hate those horse flies. All right. Here you go, buddy. Here you go. You got a big old paddock all to yourself. Look at that. You're going to love it here, honey. Yeah. Pretty boy. He is gorgeous. I love his markings. You meet the horses. Handsome boy. So I got some, gave him his probiotic paste and uh, vitamin B complex. And then I've got electrolytes and minerals in his water just from the stress, just because we were in the trailer for so long yesterday. And I don't think they drank any water for the entire ride. So I'm really worried about dehydration. So but he's got all of this room, all this fresh air. He's got plenty of water. And I'm thinking. That's where he's going to. Yep. Oh, he's looking for all of that for everyone. He's gonna be in here by himself for a little bit. I just I want Salem to get just a little bit bigger, and then we'll bring Salem in here with him. Just because we have these squares, we have a field fence, and it's a little question. So I want him to be a little bit bigger before we bring him in here with him. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Annabelle, why you not teach him about us? We've tried to desensitize him and make him chill, but he's just, nope. That is a handsome little calf though. Little chunko. What, Juniper? You see your herd mate over here? I know, pretty girl. She, oh my God, she's so vocal. All right, now for Miss Rosie. We've already given her her paste. She's gonna go in with Mocha and the babies. There we go. It's okay, honey. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Gotcha. There you go. There you go, baby. Hey. She's really jumpy. All right. Yeah. There you go, honey. All right, now this is the moment. Look at how proud she stands. She is a stunning doe. She's showing no interest in Mocha. Oh. She is. Leon over here with Salem. <laughs> they are buddies. It's okay, Rosie. She gonna investigate. She sees Salem with Leon, so she's like, what the heck? Oh, I'm gonna turn the fence on. Give her her space. <laughs> well, it looks like Salem's just found content with you. It's just pretty content with you, Leon. Hi, right, buddy. I'm going to come sit with you over here with Salem. 
I am I loving Salem. her. I'm loving her body confirmation. She is gorgeous. I told Salem a story. Very he deep bodied. It. Hi, pretty girl. Salem liked the story that I told him. Yeah? Mm hmm. Mocha wants to meet you, Rosie, but you keep walking away from her. I think Mocha's just happy to have companions at this point, which I think is good. I think this helped the introduction a lot. <laughs> well, why don't you get out of the sun, Juniper? We got shade over here. Oh, it's Juniper, Juniper. not Juniper. Yeah, Juniper, like the tree. Hi, I see you, Rosie. We're just hanging out, baby. Don't mind us. I'm going to get in the goat shelter. No, 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 just stay here. Salem, I'm sitting here with you. Salem's hanging out. He's happy. Hi, Salem. There you go. Get some food. You got all kinds of food to eat. Yeah. This paddock had a few days rest from the goats. Mocha wants to meet you, Rosie. Hi. It's okay, baby. So we introduced Miss Rosie and the babies to Mocha. Mocha is not showing any aggression towards them at all. No setting the pecking order. Rosie is so terrified. She, Mocha tries to introduce herself, but Rosie just will not go anywhere near her. So they're good. Mocha's not even trying to attack them. If anything, she actually likes the babies. She's a good mama. You're, you're our pasture mama, huh, Mocha? You and Annabelle. I know, baby. They'll warm up to you, honey. But Rosie's got her companions from her herd, so she's, she knows she's happy. So they're all here. Mr. Mr. Shadow is over there. And then all we gotta do is just address Salem's pot belly issue. I spoke with the breeder and they are dewormed regularly. So they were just dewormed a month ago. Um, I don't think it is tapeworms because that was kind of what I was worried about. Um, could be coccidiosis, but coccidia, but I don't think it is, but that is possible. So we're going to, I'm doing my research here. I'm going to reach out to our vet and we're going to get him taken care of. I think he might have a mineral or protein deficiency because that is also a common cause of pot belly. So we're going to see because all the rest of them are healthy. All the rest of them are fine. He might just have not gotten enough. Sometimes uh, one out of the bunch does not get as much as the others. He is very sweet, kind, gentle. He's probably just got bullied. So we're gonna see, we're gonna work with him, get that pot belly corrected, but the rest of them, they're excellent shape. Rosie is just, hey look, you look at her. She is just, she's stunning. She is, I think, everything you want in a myotonic fainting goat. She's deep bodied, good build beautiful stature. Hi, pretty girl. She's really lovely, so. It's really exciting. That gives us a good diversity of colors in our herd. And, uh, yeah. So, we're gonna go ahead and let them settle. We gotta go get Sophie and her babies from our friends where they stayed so that they could be monitored. And we're gonna bring them home with us to hang out in the trailer so I can see them together make sure that she's doing good with them and then we'll bring them out to start to introduce them to the new ones. Just got back to the house with Sophie and her babies in tow. I'm gonna go ahead and let them out. We've got them in like kind of like a dog crate for the ride. That way they can be with her, but they don't. Cause I mean, our trailer, you see how there's like kind of like that little lip there. It's just a little questionable. We worry about it possibly, them possibly somehow slipping out from under cause they're so tiny. All right, here, Sophie, I'm gonna get your babies out. You being such a good mama. Come on, little ones. Hi. Come on, babies. Oh my gosh, you guys are so tiny. Hi. Oh, yes. Come here. Come here. Look at how tiny. There you go. Go here, mama. Go, mama. She, she's calling you. Come here, cutie. There you go. Come here. There you go, cuties. All the new goats on the farm. Come here. 
Here you go, Sophie. I hear you calling them baby. You are your, your baby. You are such a good mama. Oh, I'm not your mama. <laughs> Here you go, guys. There's your mama. Here you go. Here you go. Come on, mama. Oh, you're done nursing. There we go. Healthy little babies. That's such a good mama, Sophie. So proud of you. I'm so proud of you. Look at the little tail wagon. Oh, you got poop on your butt. You got poop on your butt, mama. Your baby has poop on his butt. You gotta clean your baby off. Healthy little baby. Yep, it comes with the territory. Be a mama, Sophie. You gotta clean off your baby. I'm gonna let them have some time. She's been doing really, really good with them, so I'm gonna let them be out with her. Take her off of their lead rope now that we're here and we're stationary. There you go, mama. There you go. That's such a good mama, Sophie. I'm gonna refill your water, baby.